Hey guys, I am back here for another pop figure review. I have two more that I got. Um, I haven't reviewed any for a while. And I didn't review these two at all. Well, me, I reviewed Groot. And he wasn't a Lego haul video, which I decided not to upload because reasons. I don't know. Um, and I don't think I actually ever uploaded him either, but it was in my small video. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so I got two pop figures on my local Hastings. Wow, I never thought I'd get either one of these because one was like from 2013 and it's like between 1570, no, between 1580, I believe, on eBay. And then the other one came out like this summer, I think. Maybe, maybe it was last year, actually. No, I think it was like springtime this year, actually. I don't know. But he's like 40 on eBay, and there there was I want I, 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 I was just gonna get one pop figure um like Robocop, but they were out of all of them like whatever. Um, and then I saw these, and then the PX exclusives, Red Suit Rocket, which that was 15 instead of 10. So they had like they had like nine of those. Not very rare then, but whatever. <laughs> Still pretty rare, probably, I don't know. Um, anyways, so, I got both of these, because they were just one, um, vinyl for each. I'm like, whatever, and then I got them. Because I didn't know when they were going to be back. Because I've only seen two of these guys. Um, the one that I got, and then there was one more today, and I got him, like, early June or July whenever these came out and then I only saw one Ant-Man there and I, they've never came back and that was like when I that was like the week before I saw him <clears throat> so I don't know my store is weird whatever boom Deathstroke Arrow version for Deathstroke and Deadpool so I'm gonna start with Deathstroke and yeah okay so here's the Arrow thing. He is in the television line instead of the heroes line, which, I don't know. Whatever. Um, very nice. Vinyl figure, 14 plus. 210 in the television line. I think I might already said that, though. Here's the side of them. There's that. Here's the other era figures. We have Oliver Queen, which they did have there. The arrow. The arrow unmasked. Um, Black and Air, which they also had there. Deathstroke, which is in my hand. Uh, Deathstroke Unmasked, which I believe is a Hot Topic exclusive, I think. And then John Diggle, which is a 2015 Comic-Con exclusive, which I think they'll get him in his Season 4 suit, which it's like a black Mega Man costume without the giant cannon, honestly, if you haven't seen it. IGN put up a video of it, it's kind of... I don't know what to think of it. Anyways... That is really cool. And then Deadpool. You know, I do have a few complaints about the box and stuff, which I didn't. I would. I sort of. I still would have gotten it after I already seen these. But um, yeah. So there were these things were on the box, which I just said. I don't know. I'm saying that again. Um, so the box is pushed up a little bit. Oh, there it's not. Um, there's like a little rip right there in the box and then you cannot see it I think mean, there's like a little paint okay you can kinda see a, li a little black paint line on the arm honestly all that I think is just super nitpicking except this thing and they tear a little bit I do not know how that got there but I think what might happen is someone's like throwing it up and they didn't catch it, and then boom, 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 but, I don't know. Yeah, I don't really care, it's a Deadpool. This guy is, like, super expensive because it's Deadpool, I mean, similar to Deathstroke, but not as much. And then this guy, um, yeah, I don't know if you can see, but right there, 2013, and I believe Pops, um, Funko started making Pops in 2012 or 13. So, see, and he's number 20 in the Marvel line, instead of 210. 
So we got Dark Phoenix, Beast, Deadpool, Doctor Doom, Ghost Rider, and Silver Surfer. And I looked him up. He's like 50 on eBay. And I've never seen one in person before. So... Yeah. Really cool. So I'm gonna... Oh yeah, and by the way, this is the bobblehead version. And uh, the Star Wars 7 pop figures came out. And I can do like a full video... Oh, those I didn't get any of them, but there's, like, so much. I might, like, um, do, like, a... Just show them to you on my computer. There's, like, a exclusive for Best Buy, Target, Walmart, GameStop, Entertainment Earth, Amazon. I don't know why they have all these exclusives, but whatever. I guess it gets some money or something. Um, and then besides the exclusives, there's still, like, quite a bit for just one movie. I don't know, maybe that was just me. They didn't have any of those there. I was hoping they'd have, like, Kylo Ren or Finn. Or Kylo Finn, which Kylo Finn is not a character, but, I mean... Wait, could it be Finn is Kylo Ren? Or maybe Finn's last name is Calrissian, and Lando is his father. I don't know. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna open these up real quick, um, I don't know where I'm gonna put them on my display, I guess I could put, like, one in front of Batman and then one in front of Punisher, but then you wouldn't really be able to see either one, um, I might, like, I could maybe put Death like, right here, I think put Deadpool, like, right here, kind of, to where you could still see it, you know, I don't know, and then I noticed, um, I have one, two, four, I believe. Yeah, four, um, figures. I have more bobbleheads than figures. And let's see, I've spent 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, basically $90, give or take, because both of these were nine, and he was misprinted as nine, so I got him, and my, the, uh, Entertainment Earth, Glow in the Dark Thanos, is no longer at my Hastings, which is not Entertainment Earth, so I don't know why they'd have that in the first place. Whatever. I'm gonna open these like I said I would, um, three minutes ago. Okay, guys, I've opened them up, and they look really cool. Um, another thing I noticed about Deadpool's is on the bottom, um, you can see his face, like, right here, which is not on Deathstrokes, obviously. And, um, another thing you guys might know is, if you open them from the bottom, you can see a continuation of the head. You can kind of see the grade there. Um, that's pretty cool, so I'm going to do, um, Deadpool first, and since he's a bobblehead, he cannot stand up on his own on the carpet. Um, you guys might already know that. Um, really nice pop. Um, there's, they also had X-Force, X-Men Deadpool there, by the way. Um, well, that's the... All the red is blue, and all the black is yellow, so pretty cool. Um, here's a katana. He's got, yeah, there's a little paint smudge. You can barely see it, but I mean, like right there, that black line. That's like super nitpicking. And then right there is a real little red mark on the katana. It goes all the way around, super nitpicky, and I really do not care. Um, uh, there's a pistol. Then on the back is two sleeves for the katanas, and I think he should have one in the pocket thing, but he doesn't. Because reasons, I don't know. And there's a little bump thing he's got, I don't know what that's called. There's a little curl on the mask, which... He sometimes has actually quite a bit. And then here is a gun. It looks like a AK-47 almost, but mixed with a pistol. So they probably just did that because to kind of shrink it down a bit. Oh my goodness, this guy went up. My guy said he wants to stay up. Next is Deathstroke, and he looks super nice. Super cool, um, really like this katana, not katana, well, I guess it's kind of a katana. This sword he has, I really like it, um, really like the head detail, 
right here on the side and then on the side too is the same detail and then the black is still down here really nice there's the little belt and everything and then he has a little band thing back here little lines there's some nitpicking but uh, like I said I do not care there's like a little scratch up oh, nitpicking but I, well, I don't care I don't even know why I pointed that out because guess who doesn't care the guy reviewing it for you oh there's a little, some marks maybe these little dents right here on the head are supposed to be there to show he's like been in battle I don't know Here's the top of him. Really, really nice figure. So, Deadpool and Deathstroke. Big enemies. In a way. And honestly, I kind of prefer Deathstroke over Deadpool. Not because Deadpool is a copy, but... I don't know. I don't know. I actually don't know if that's true. I, I'm not for sure. I'm more into DC anyway. So a guy like me would kind of say that. Um. Okay. Wait. Never mind. I can. I can put them by smog, and you can still tell who everybody in the box are. So there. They are Deadpool and Deathstroke. Really happy I got them. So. Could you kind of pin over everybody? My first one, Marty, Yellow Jacket, Unmasked Batman. No, wait, Punisher. And then I got Unmasked Batman. Then I got, um, Smog, uh, Age of Ultron Hawkeye. No, Dancing Groot, Age of Ultron Hawkeye. Then I got, um, Deadpool, then Deathstroke, technically, because I grabbed him first. No way, but the cashier, I think, scanned Deathstroke first. So, technically, I got him first. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know, whatever. Uh, yeah. And then there's my Bible. What am I? I have, like, 12. Oh, there's another one. And uh, there's another one. Uh, anyway. And, oh, there's another one. Oh, there's that. Other, there's another one. Yeah. Deadpool and Deathstroke, guys. Um. Yeah, so thank you, Store, for having these. I'm just going to give you a big thumbs up right now. Thanks, Store. And thanks, people, who are awesome enough to not skip through the video like some people I know. Um, they're just skipping through them and actually listen to my commentary. Because, honestly, I do that with a lot of Michael MGF's videos. Because, honestly, it should not take... 25 minutes to review a painted figure but that's a rant for another day that I probably won't do unless you guys are like begging me to which I doubt you will oh here's a purple hand from for Legos I don't know if you knew that um yeah um, I did my DC review of everything there's Jethro there's Arrowverse anyways um I did my DC review, my uh, minifigure collection update for September. Sorry that's late. Um, and then my Marvel one I'm going to do sometime this week. I'm hoping... Oh, whoa, I almost dropped the camera. Okay, um, I kind of did, actually. And, and there's something very important I need to tell you guys, and I'm very sorry for doing it. I left Superman out of the video. Oh, I'm serious, guys. I'm like super legit. I forgot him. I mean, legitimately serious. I forgot him. I don't like him that much. Um, let's see. I, li I like Scooby Doo better. I like the Joker better. Actually, I think Best Superman's better than Joker. I don't know. I don't really like either one that much. Um, I like Robin better. Alfred. Um, Alfred's really cool, guys. He. The sad thing is, people give more appraisal for Alfred than Aquaman, but anyways, that's a story for another day, Batgirl, actually, it's like Superman better than Batgirl, but anyways, Bat's, uh, no, Superman's way better, we choose Fox, he's Morgan Freeman, what's not to like, Man Bat, I go on and on, I don't really like Superman that much, he's not my least favorite, he's not my number one, I don't want to put him, like, 
beneath the garbage can just at the bottom of the bar garbage can. He's not underneath it. Whatever. Because I think I might have skipped over him because he was right here. I don't even know if he wants I went like this. I think for the review suit. You might be able to see him right there. If you can, point it out. And yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry about that, guys. Um, I maybe I forgot somebody else, but I don't know. Yeah, sorry about that, guys. Um. Oh, here's his henchman guy I didn't include. He's in the prison cell. So he might be in my stop motion. Coming soon if he'll get out of here. What a loser. Uh, oh, crap, I broke it. I kind of already was broken. There he is, with his, um, knockoff Lego head. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, yeah, Deathstroke and Deadpool, guys. The only thing better is, like, if you had Deathstroke, comic book Deathstroke, Unmasked Deathstroke, Deadpool, X-Force Deadpool, X-Men Deadpool, Unmasked Deadpool, Metallic Deadpool, and Unmasked, um, X-Force Deadpool, Black and White Deadpool, um, I think that's all of them. Oh yeah, a uh, question for you guys. Um, I'm gonna ask. Do you think they'll make a pop figures for Deadpool's new movie coming out, or do you think they'll just re-release this version? Cause the mo the suit is pretty spot on to the comic outfit. I don't know. Oh, there's Hulk. And Hulk. There's Spider Man. Um, yeah, I never noticed that art. Um, yeah, wow, that's 20 minutes, guys, pretty much. But part of that was to apologize to you guys for 60 minutes. I'm going to end it now with my face that I barely show.